Hey, what's up, man? I got a 1925 high school yearbook showing John Wayne in his senior year. Hi, ho Silver. John Wayne wasn't the Lone Ranger. Oh. I came down to the pawn shop to sell my 1925 high school yearbook of John Wayne. I like westerns, but John Wayne never really appealed to me, so I really like some extra cash to go on a vacation. I'm asking $1,500 for the yearbook. I purchased this for only $1, so I'm hoping to make a big profit. So where'd you get this, man? I actually came across this at an estate sale. Here's a picture of him in his class photo. What was his name? It was Marion Morrison? Marion Morrison was his name. I thought his name was John Wayne. A lot of the time, they change their names in Hollywood. Marion Morrison just isn't the name of the quintessential cowboy tough guy. I guess it kind of worked out for him. He started working in a Hollywood prop department. I think they needed a guy that kind of looked like John Wayne one day, and they just grabbed him and threw him on set. And next thing you know, he's probably one of the biggest movie stars of all time. What can you say about John Wayne? I mean, the guy is just an icon. But when it came to playing roles in Western and war movies, this guy pretty much wrote the book. I think it's funny how they dressed up for picture day in school back then. If I remember correctly, your mom used to dress you up and do your hair. <laughs> My mom never dressed me once for picture day. I just remember you trying to ruin the yearbook for everybody. I can't help it I was born this beautiful. Looks like he probably played something on defense. I know he was football. He went to uh, USC on a scholarship. Actually going to be a lawyer. I know he was class president. He was big into the arts, dance, speaker, chairman, really involved in his senior year. Man, this guy's all over the yearbook. I have no doubt that this is an authentic John Wayne yearbook, but without a signature, the value really drops. So what do you want to do with this, man? I'm asking uh, 1500 And I'm going to offer you half of that. Pretty recently, I got a Reagan yearbook in here, and it was a hard sell. How about nine? I'll go up to eight. 850? 800 bucks, man. I promise you I can live without the yearbook. Considering that uh, what I paid for it was a heck of a lot less, I'll go ahead and take that offer. All right, man, cool. Thanks. Sean, you gonna write him up? When he made an offer of 750, I was completely shocked. I would have taken it, but I figured I would see how much more I can get. And now I'm just waiting to go on that trip. Wow, this thing is nice. This is a casting out. This is like one of the holy grails of American coins. I'll do 95 and that's it. No, I don't think so. I think I'm going to take it home.